Welcome to a new video. Let's check it out. New UL device. It is the new G3 Pro. But Jamie, JP, viewers, not only is the device new, there's some new pods on here, buddy. There's a new 3 mil 0.4 ohm pod that can handle up to 35 watts maximum. Pretty crazy. That's a lot. Bust this one open. We got a 0.4 and a 0.9. And a 0.6. We got all three. Shit. Honestly, a lot bigger than I thought it was going to be. Yeah, she's a little girthy. You want to know why? Guess the milliamp hour on that bad boy right there. 1500? <laughs> no, it's a thousand milliamp hour. Look at that. Kind of cool, man. Yeah, really nice screen. And this has fine tuning airflow, they're calling it. So pretty much it's a big old hole and you can, sorry, fat fingering it, but you can just like ever so slightly move that thing. Just use your finger at that. Wasper took out half of it on. See? <laughs> <laughs> perfect. <laughs> you see that? It's perfect. Let's fill that pot up. Fill it up, fill it up. I know you said it was- Oh, 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 oh! Here's the other two pods we get. I'm pretty sure this is the 0.4 big old 35 watt three mil pod, and then there's your 0 0.9. We're gonna use the one in the middle though, the 0.6. Nice man, I like it. It's USB-C charge. Oh, it goes from five to 35 watts. It's got the full size screen. Oh, it is compatible with the G pods only, the G3 pods only. Give us a minute. Let me let this juice soak up in that there pod and we'll be right back. And we're back. She's ready to go. We got a little busy there for a minute. We did. Had about 18 of them. Mm -hmm. So look here. This thing got that smart mode in it. Automatically adjusts you to 25. Which is what the middle of the rating for this pod is. Airflow about halfway. Yeah, we got the airflow about halfway there. Got the 0.6 pod in here. When he's dancing, you know it's happy and you know it's broken. Mm. Mm. First impressions rating on the pod. I'm gonna compare it to flavor with what I know from them before. I'm gonna give it like an eight and a half, nine. Out of? Out of 10. It's pretty high. <laughs> out of 100. <laughs> yeah. No, out of 10. So. Like, and that's out of box. We let it soak. It'd probably been in there, what, maybe 10 minutes? Yeah, not long. <clears throat> Excuse me. But with these, it just feels like a broken in pod. Mm -hmm. It's so crazy. Like, the newer the newer stuff's getting wild. But the flavor's just so good. I love their products. The device feels good, too. And I will say, I'm more of a minimalist these days. And the big old flashy RGBs and all that ain't my drift, but... They did this well. Like, look at the angle I'm looking at this. Like, look at the angle of that device in my face right now. I can read that as if I was looking at it straight forward. I like that it has button fire or auto fire. It's nice, dude. I want you to try it. Tell me what you think. Right off, I mean, the weight's there. You definitely feel like you have something quality. I like where they put the button right off. Like, I picked it up and it fell. Right on your right thumb. Right on it. Mm -hmm. I like it. The screen, like you said, is very, very, very uh, readable. Very clean. Let's see how she chooches. Rip it. Cheese. I mean, the flavor's there. It's although it's a uh, what, what pot is this? It's the point six. Point six. I, I thought it was the point four. I was gonna say although it's the point four, it hits a little lot like, cooler than I would imagine, but it's the point six. So. Now that one's on 25. Now the .4 is uh, regulated with their smart stuff to be at 35. There you go. Yeah. I like this a lot. Plus to be a thousand milliamp hour. That should probably, that should last a man all day, especially if you're going to be using it, you know, like on the 12 or 15 or 20 side, it should last you all day, if not longer. I know this little a3 I got in my pocket. I go about 24 hours on the battery. You can almost like just straight 
straight inhale it wide open. That's how much airflow it kind of gives you. Yeah. I just like halfway with the 25 watt. It just felt good. I like warm. it. You will hardly ever do anything that's below par with, you know, really good stuff. Yeah, they do. Anything they do is done well mm -hmm. and with quality. And what I like about them is even though they're fairly high on the quality side, in my opinion, the price is down. Well, one of our... Uh, they're very affordable, man. Yeah, one of our more affordable devices that we carry and sell to most people is a UL product. Yep. I agree. And what I use and recommend every day, I, you know, I work here, we, would, we do 12 hour shifts three to four days a week. We're here. And this is every time someone's wanting to switch from a disposable or wanting to quit smoking, I recommend this. And here, you know, a little higher online maybe, but we sell this for 30 bucks in here. The, the amount of quality and just product you get for that price is nuts. And like this, for example, <clears throat> in here, I could see us selling this for around the forty dollar range. Thirty five, thirty nine, yeah. Yeah. I mean, you know, sure it's a little <coughs> bit bigger than whatever, but the battery's there, the screen's there, all the information you want, you can adjust it. It's wicked. Yep. I love it. It looks so nice, dude. I like the little touches, uh, you know, you can barely see it. it says G three up there on the corner. I just like it, man. It's just a good looking, good quality device. I agree. If this device interests you, I highly recommend you go check it out for yourself. Go to your local vape shop, see if they've got it. Get your own nubs on it, check it out, see what you think. Maybe give it a try. Thank you, UL, so much for sending this to us. Thank you guys for watching. That's going to be it from us. Hopefully we'll see you soon. Goodbye.